What's going on guys, it's Greg from ECD and welcome to Accessory Review 2.0. The first one was so successful you guys all really loved it and there are so many innovative cool lacrosse accessories, uh, lacrosse players starting their own businesses that there's a lot to cover. So we've got a whole new bunch here that I want to go over for you guys. So first up we have Sports Star Chin Straps. They got in touch with us and wanted to show their line of chin straps. Uh, a lot of these look like traditionally what would be for football for chin straps. Uh, but we had the whole crew here try them on and they are really, really comfortable. I've um, never been a huge fan of the stock Cascade chin strap and some of these are really cool options. So they've got um, like a hard cup with a soft foam inside and then kind of the, there we go, there we go. And they've got kind of the same thing with like a gel liner, which was really, really comfortable and it really seats your chin in there really securely so I can see it being even maybe a little bit more safe uh, but definitely really comfortable. The one that I like the most uh, looks very similar to a standard lacrosse chin strap, but instead of this material being uh, like a thicker leather that's kind of uncomfortable, it's this really soft kind of like I don't know, neoprene material. Um, pretty similar shape, just much softer and much, much more comfortable. So this is a really cool line of products. They've also got, you know, covers which some lacrosse guys make. Um, and they've got these interesting write your own message on eye black stickers which we might try out and see how they feel. Not much of an eye black push myself, but the chin straps are really cool. Cool options for comfort and safety. Next up, we have a product. I met the inventor of this at the lacrosse convention. He was a really great guy. Uh, just really excited about lacrosse. This is the Head Rock uh, lacrosse accessory. And so basically what it is, it's a weight that weighs about the same as a lacrosse ball um, and an elastic band. So you take it and you put it on your stick um, and it goes with the elastic over the head there um, and it's kind of tapered and tight so it won't come off. And so what it does is it places a weight exactly where the ball would be. So if you're a young kid wanting to learn lacrosse um, and you want to do some work indoors, you can take this around and cradle, throw a little bit, get used to the weight of what a lacrosse ball would be without having to worry about dropping it in the house. So it's a great little tool. Uh, maybe for younger players that are looking to get some extra time with their stick inside um, and get the real feel of the lacrosse ball. There. Next up, we have the glove sticks and the shoe sticks. We were actually lucky to meet this inventor as well. Uh, she came into the office, gave us a little presentation on it. It was really cool. She has actually been on Shark Tank with this product, so we've got some full national exposure. Next into the tank is a solution for a stinky problem. Hi, sharks. My name is Krista Woods. And if you stink, it's not my fault. <laughs> but basically it is a deodorizing product uh, that you got these plastic tubes with some holes and a deodorizer goes in there. So it's meant to dry out your gloves, dry out your shoes and make sure that they don't smell. So there's a different version for shoes and gloves. Um, we've tried this stuff here at the office because we have our workout shoes here and, and our gloves that stay in our bag. Um, and since we don't play that often, it goes a long time between playing. And these really work well. Everyone here really seems to love them. I meant to mention in the beginning that the links for all this stuff will be down in the description. Say at the end. I'll go through to the end, Pat. Don't tell me what to do. <laughs> Next, we have the Twin Lacrosse Trinity Shaft. This is a really cool one. I uh, also met these guys at LaxCon. The founders are twins. I'm a twin. Thought that was pretty cool. More twin lacrosse entrepreneurs. Basically, what this is, is a collapsible shaft. And there's a couple advantages here for young players. Uh, it comes with this handy dandy little strap here. So it has one 30 inch section, another 30 inch section, and then the connecting piece. So uh, it's great for young players. If you don't know what position you're gonna be playing yet, uh, maybe you play some long pole, maybe you play some short pole. You don't have to buy two different poles. You can just get the one that if you play a long pole in one practice, then short uh, after a couple months, you can just break it into two short poles that you can still have. Uh, the other big advantage is for traveling. If you guys have ever flown, you know that you cannot fly with a full length lacrosse ball or even a put together short stick. So this allows you to break it down and makes you don't have to check another bag. So every time you would have flown with a lacrosse stick, you pretty much saved the 50 bucks that it would cost to check an additional bag. Uh, so it works pretty easy. You've got the connector and some push pins. Um, slides in, locks into place. And you got the other one, slides in locks in place uh, and then you've got your 60 inch shaft. Also work well if you don't have that big of a car. It's tough to fit a full long pole. So then you just take it and pop one section off and stick it in pretty much any trunk. So this is a pretty cool product, especially for younger guys 
who are doing switching positions or not ready to commit to whatever they're doing. Samurai Jack. Last but not least, my favorite of the bunch, we have the Samurai Jacket from Encore Lacrosse. Got in touch with the guys over there and they whipped up a fully custom one. So first off, this is a really nice jacket. The materials, the build, the cutting and stitching, all the details, uh, the piping. Really, really high quality jacket. Uh, they embroidered our ECD Lacrosse logo right there on the front. Got custom colors, a nice pocket there on the front. Uh, but the big difference is in the Samurai jacket is the stick holder on the back. So you can see they've got one loop up here at the top and another loop down here at bottom. Uh, so when you put it on, here we go. Oh, they've also got these cool little, uh, little hand sleeves. Keep your, keep your hands warm. So you've got the stick holder right there, like a samurai sword, right on your back, goes right through the straps. Then when you're ready to play, pop it out. Boom, stick's always right where you need it. So I thought this was a really cool uh, invention. Those guys are always doing some apparel that's really cool and unique. And I saw this and knew that ECD had to have one. All right, guys, that is it for Accessory Review 2.0. All the links for these products will be down in the description if you want to go check them out. Make sure you go support these lacrosse entrepreneurs. It's really cool what they're doing. So let me know in the comments if there's any other products you want us to review. We're going to keep looking around, gathering up accessories, and doing hopefully one of these every time we have five or six cool things to cover. So thanks for watching. Make sure to let me know in the comments what your favorite item was. Mine, definitely the samurai jacket. So thanks for watching. Like the video if you liked it. Subscribe if you haven't. And have a great day. Right. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> okay.